What's up guys, David here with another video, and this time I have a special treat for you guys. I am playing MOG8 on Call of Duty Ghost in Strike Zone, and I will be showing off how to play OBJ object. Uh, if you guys don't know what OBJ means, it's objective type player. Uh, a lot of MOG teams like Optic and all of them, they all have types of roles. I'm pretty sure Nade Shot is the OBJ player on Optic. But uh, OBJ players, basically all they do, all they go for the objective, uh, flags, everything like that, um, blitz, the slayers, all they do is try to get the spawns so they could just spawn trap while the OBJ players do their job. And uh, this time I'm going to be showing off the Vector, which is probably the most overused gun on MOG ever in Call of Duty Ghost. You don't, this is the gun that you want to use. But now since Call of Duty Ghost is coming to an end, because of Advanced Warfare, I'll be showing you guys how to play that game too. Uh, MOG types, I'm pretty sure they have Capture the Flag back. I was, I was a fan of Capture the Flag uh, in, Modern Warfare two, um, in yeah, Modern Warfare 3, which uh, I started competitive play Modern Warfare 3. That was probably my favorite game, and the game I was the best at because I almost... Uh, I was on Team Critical and all that. And uh, yeah, but like... Um, this game, I am, uh, I'm just showing off how to do objectives, uh, objective type. Basically, I'm just sticking around flags. Uh, there's one rule that all the objective type players go by, and that's just, if you have two flags up and they only have one, and they start capturing, let's say you have, uh, A and B and they have C, uh, you wanna go, if they start capturing A, then you go back to, you go around and you get C. So it's just it's rotation. You always have to keep the rotation up. That's the objective. If you if you're an objective type player and you can get kills and keep the keep the rotation going, well, um, that that all the teams are gonna want you because not a lot of people can uh, know the maps and know the rotations and get the amount of kills that it takes to be an objective type player. Not saying that you need a lot a lot of like gun skill. Or get a lot of kills so you can be a good OBJ, because there's a, there's a lot of people in a pro circuit that like that only get let's say six kills per game and they have like what ten caps and they clutch it for their team all the whole entire time. Not saying that you need to get kills. It's just it's better to have gun skill because there's sometimes you're gonna be stuck in those moments, those clutch moments where you're gonna need to at least have gun skill to get out of. Smarts isn't like always gonna ever. Yeah, smarts is like yeah, bad accuracy. But uh, but smarts isn't always gonna you know. Oh yeah, that guy does three like 720, but he still gets them. That's why the vector is OP because you could like hit fire someone across the map, get get a kill just by you know hitting them with three bullets in the chest. But yeah, off topic, but but um, yeah, like you could be the best objective type player, and if you have gun skill, that's just gonna make you better because that as like scumpy he's a slayer but he always uses submachine guns you know i've never seen him with an assault rifle like the the usually the people with assault rifles are like proofy and clayser but uh like scump and nature always have subs they always have subs and the vector is the best sub to do it with but uh in that game i'm pretty sure they're gonna have in advanced warfare they're gonna have some good guns i'll be talking about the guns and all of them and what uh, guns are going to be an MLG and all the game types in another video but yeah I'm just like objective players all you need to know for every single Call of Duty game even if you play Destiny um, MLG you need to know that every objective type player needs to go for the objectives and like don't care about the kills as much as you care about getting your team up there and you need to know the spawns, you need to know the maps, you need to know everything. Because objective players are probably the, like, the best and the most important type players in the game. There's not a lot of objective players, there's a lot of slayers. Um, but like, if you're an objective player, learn learn at it and you get like a team will find you instantly. But yeah, I hope this video helped you guys. Um, hit that like button, subscribe, and uh, peace out for more uh, video game content.